So what was Fenmont like? Come on, you have to tell me everything. Was it like super cosmopolitan? Were you able to make friends? I don't know. It was pretty normal. What, that's it? That's all you have to say? You're always boring everyone with long-winded explanations, but when I ask a question, I get the cold shoulder. Come on, you're blowing things out of proportion. Listen, you're gonna talk and you're gonna tell me everything. You have ten seconds. Ten, nine, eight. Well, there was a nurse at the school named Prin who was always really nice to me. But on the day I went to see my professor, I got attacked by a girl in red clothes. So then, I couldn't go back to the school anymore. Although that did result in me meeting Mila. Oh, and in terms of other friends, I met this girl named Elise. Fine, I got it. Message received loud and clear. You met all sorts of other girls while you were away. Good job, Jude. I'm so happy for you. I see you haven't changed a bit. You asked! <laughs> Notice how Jude tactfully decided to mention every girl he's met, though, and only the girls. Not like thinking on it now, I'm pretty sure he did that on purpose. I, I think he's just, just to get a rise yeah. out of me, out of Leia. Hey, so uh, welcome back to some Tales of Zillia. Uh, quick thing to explain, actually. Yeah. So we had some technical difficulties. It's gonna be okay. But um, while recording the previous episode, we my graphics card died because I'm the most unlucky person with technology ever. So I've noticed. It's If it's not one thing, it's another with you when it comes to technology. Yeah, so um, long story short, we lost some footage. Luckily, it was all cutscenes about us uh, um, arriving here in La Ronde. We're actually a little bit ahead of it right now. So um, I was able to get that footage from another YouTuber uh, that I'm not sure how to pronounce it but that youtuber's name is on the screen right now mm -hmm. um they do several non-voiced playthroughs of games so if you're ever interested in like watching gameplay without commentary you know that that's something to think about i'll put a link in the description but i'm going to put our audio from that part that we recorded over the cutscenes generously recorded by somebody else and it might be a little bit messy putting it together but we'll pick up right after I edit that together. All right then, sounds good. Let's go. Welcome back to some Tales of Zillia. I'm the Comic Foil. I'm the Green Scorpion. And we just arrived in... All the seaports look the same. They guess, really do. I don't really have a problem with that, I guess. But um, <laughs> we're in... Yes, this is Laronde. Yes. La I, I, yeah, I thought maybe we were just near Laronde. But no, this is... This is my hometown. This yep. is... Yep. Jude's hometown. Yep, so in the last episode, uh, things happened. A lot of things happened. Uh, but the main thing is, right now, we are here in uh, Jude's hometown to... They say that back during the mining boom, this whole street was packed with merchant stalls. Is that right? I was just thinking how much this quiet little street fits you. Aw. Yeah, oh, I guess so. But, uh, yeah, basically, uh, Mila is paralyzed from the, uh, from the, uh, hip down. Yep. We need to fix that. So, we are here in, uh, Jude's hometown, where supposedly his dad... His dad knows, is, like, might, a renowned... ...might know, might yeah. know something that can help. I I'm really excited to meet his parents, actually. I can't get over the fact that we, like, just happened to find someone with a wheelchair. Jude! How's the big city treating you? Do you like the capital? Hmm? Who's this? Is that my mom? Kind of looks like me. Oh, you ready to see me now, Doctor? I'm sorry, everyone. We have an urgent case here. You'll have to come back in the afternoon. Yeah, we're skipping the list. They're, they're understanding, though. Or they understand seeing like seeing what's in front of them. Sorry, everybody. We'll catch you later. Promise. <laughs> You've really gotten into the swing of things here, Alea. Best nurse in town. Oh, she's a nurse. Also, the only nurse in town. But hey, you know how it is. Best nurse in town holds <laughs> unsanctioned wheelchair races. What are those like wing-like things on her back? Bring her in. Oh, she has little decolletage. Okay, All right, maybe so here we go. Maybe that isn't his mom. I just thought the hair color seemed similar. So what's going on? Yes. 
Try not to worry. Your friend is in good hands. Have faith in your dad. You look like you've been through the ringer. Want to tell me about it? Wait, are you or are you not my mom? Yeah. Yes. He, yes. Okay, she, yeah, she is. I don't even know where to start, Mom. She didn't give a kind of How like, oh, beginning? it's been a long time since I've seen you or anything like that. Well, I guess it all began with my professor back in Fenmont. Doctor! Hello. Doctor. We have no time for exposition. Yes, what's wrong? My grandpa was working on the roof and he fell. He's out cold. Don't worry, I'll be right there. See here, that would be like three hours waiting to, to get into the bit. emergency Hold room. Hold on the fort, will you? Huh? But you just got here. I'm sorry. We'll have to catch up later. It's fine, Mom. Duty calls. I mean, I understand somebody's dying. <laughs> I mean, all things considered. You, you can play the your parents are too busy to spend time with you card, but if Looks like people are actually baby. dying if it's they don't do their jobs. Now, huh? <laughs> um Cry baby? I hardly ever cried as a kid. <laughs> I was just trying to get a rise from you. You're no fun. Hmm. So serious. I guess the big city turned you into a bona fide adult. He's embarrassed. <laughs> These awkward silences. Hey, Dad. Come with me. Jeez. Oh, no, like, good to see you, son. I mean, maybe you have grave news, but still, you could have thrown him. Could have thrown him some pleasantries. Uh huh. The patient is suffering from more than just leg injuries. Your journey has left her with a drastically weakened immune system. Why didn't you prescribe rest? <sighs> that's kind of a long story. Answer me. Surely they taught you better than this. Oh, that's... okay. You're this I'm... kind of dad. I'm yep. Sorry. Have you informed her of the nature of her condition? I did. I told her you might be able to heal her. So you lied to her. What? It's the truth, isn't it? You've done it before. <sighs> Jude, Jude, Jude. You seem to think that using an asparixis is a simple procedure. As routine as an appendectomy. In this case, it is impossible. But, Dad... Jude! The device attaches directly to the nerves and causes incredible agony. Few patients can bear it. Why exactly are you home, anyway? What happened to med school? Answer me, young man. So this is how you're gonna be? That's gotta be a hard thing to tell your parents, though. Mm -hmm. Jude! Thank you for the I dropped out of college and joined a JRPG quest. <laughs> what got into him? <sighs> the procedure might be explained in the medical files. If Dad won't help me, I'll do it myself. Better check the archives. Here we go. We got a new mission. Okay. So, you notice the name that he used to describe this procedure, right? In Aspirix? As Aspirixis. Aspirixis, which is like Spyrix, which is like the thing Mila was trying to destroy in the first place. Bingo! I figure he uses a similar reword. Oh, thanks. Hey, Leia! I knew you wouldn't give up just because your dad turned you away. Thanks, Leia. Alright. What do we got? I, I remember this part particularly because wow. I remember this moment man really is quite a, a bit. They sure didn't teach us techniques like this at med school. Apparently, it requires a special stone. The kind of stone isn't written here, though. Yeah. Dad took detailed notes of the entire procedure. As long as we have the device, we should be able to heal Mila. But is Mila up for it? I heard the last patient to undergo the procedure cried uncle after eight seconds. 
He chose to remain paralyzed rather than endure the treatment. Yes, but this is like a battle-hardened... It's that painful, huh? Lord you know, of Spirits. Maybe no, you just forget Mila about will this. endure it. You know yeah. that. Your friend goes through all that torture for nothing. It's worth the risk. When we were out I'm in the field, we were, it. like, getting if bitten by dire so. wolves every day. Well, you should check the box up there. Leia seems to know quite a bit about this. It? Yeah, she's... She's their assistant. Mm-hmm. The Asperixis. Yeah. I found it after I started helping here, when I was cleaning up. Let's go to Mila's room. I want to try this. Uh, Do we wait, know what a Spyrex is too. exactly yet? Like So based on what... Okay, I guess we might as well get a little bit of an update as to like what it is. Basically, the way uh, Mila described it, a Spyrex is a machine that yeah. can be used to, to uh, create spirit arts or perform certain tasks or whatever might have you. However, it's at the cost of a spirit's life. Okay, they Sp run on spirits. Spy Spyrex kills spirits rather okay. than harness that energy like like people with the mana load. See, she's not going to want to do it if we it's like my dad hear us. killing a spirit to do it. Why not? We'll have to We're see. Gonna use the Asperixis on you now. So, do people make but the Spyrix or is it like the Blastia in Vesperia where like they were made by an old race? Uh, uh, nope. And we're just people like make picking them. them up. People make them. Okay. Here, you'll want to lay down on your side. This is illegal in so many ways. No, you think? This is theft. This is malpractice. Technically, this is trespassing. This conduct is downright Feel anything? disorderly. Any pain? No, nothing at all. My leg still won't budge either. Why isn't it working? I don't sense any mana in the stone. Your father said that an Asperixis needs a spirit fossil, or it won't work. A spirit fossil? Those things really exist? Oh, so the special stone mentioned in the medical files is a spirit fossil. Your father also said the fossil has to be used immediately after it's uncovered, or it loses its mana. Great. As if the procedure wasn't already tricky enough. Hold on. I swear I remember that they used to find spirit fossils down in the Felgana mine. Are you serious? Whoa, jeez, be quiet. It's just something my dad told me. Mila, it sounds like we need to take you out for some field medicine. That seems like a lot of work. You'll do that for me? Here. Thank you. Jude, can you help her into the wheelchair? Wait, so we're gonna what about carry you? her around? The, okay. I have to get stuff ready. I thought I was I'll gonna go the find town. the fossil and bring it back. Well, it did say that the that the spirit fossil has to be used immediately after it's extracted. I, so oh, I don't think, yeah. they're, I don't think they're gonna have enough time the to bring it back to the office before bit. it loses its power. Wow, when it says immediately, it means immediately. Oh, yeah. Alright, so we got our mission. Okay, cool. We're we're going dungeoning. This is becoming a bit of a... Who's <laughs> this guy blocking the red? Oh, oh, no, that's that, Leia. That's Leia. <laughs> My eyes weren't quite adjusting. Alright, I'm good to go. The mine's been closed for a while, so I hope you're ready for some spelunking. I believe we have... Leia in our team. Okay, so that was uh that that's everything that we previously lost. We're live again on our own footage. Yep. So, yeah, we're going to go ahead and uh, into the Voltea Woods to the what was it called again? The what mine? Um we had to get I don't know. I just know that we have Hang to on, get to uh, the mines to get pre the Press the uh, press the uh, press the objective. Um the I forget what the, okay, oh. there it is. Head through the Voltaire Woods to the Falgana Mine 
to get the spirit stone for the Asperixis to fix Mila's legs. To get the cat to chase the rat that lives in the house that Jack built. Um, um sure. Okay. Also, uh, thank you guys for telling me semi-auto. That's why I keep punching at air, because I had it set to manual instead of semi-auto. Ah, uh, okay. But let's try out our first little bit of playing as Leia. That's gonna be you. Yes, okay. So, I'm gonna be straight up honest right now. I am not the biggest fan of Leia. Um, it's not that, like, she's a bad character or anything, but she, like, in terms of combat... Which, by the way, I'm getting, like, stunlocked here. Sure are. I did use all your Lilium Orbs, so you're not starting at level zero. Yeah. She's just, like... The thing is about Leia, it, she's kind of boring. Like, sh whatever she does, other party members kind of can already do. She she fights with a staff, which is pretty cool. I appreciate it is. that. I was, I was trying, Actually, trying to heal you there. What? <laughs> the tension between these two is paramount, but it's mostly on Leia's, uh, part. Leia's elongating staff ability. After Leia evades an enemy with a back step, which I need to use more often, Me too. her staff will shimmer with a white light that lengthens the staff for a set amount of time. Basically, she is a- she is a melee ranger. So she- she's long-range melee. Long-range melee, and the funny- like, she actually behaves a lot like, uh, a lot like What's-Her-Face from, uh, Vesperia. Yeah. Um... Remind me the name. Um, uh, Judith? Uh, yes, she she behaves a lot like Judith in that she excels at aerial combos. Okay, I'm, I'm trying to heal you here. There we go. Wait, did that heal you? There you go. Okay. Not good at healing either. Okay, that's cool, though. And She's really the only aerial character we seem to have. She I is, think. but the thing is, I mean, Jude can kind of already I, do that I can anyway. Do this. <laughs> Look at me go. Okay, like right here. <laughs> Look at me go. I'm gonna try and do it. He, he, he was blocking, so it didn't really do yeah. for you. Yeah, I, I, I want to try and demonstrate it, but they're and not letting me. Enemies will always block when you're trying to do something cool. That's just the rule That's just the tales. rule of RPGs, isn't it? Yeah. Well, maybe not RPGs, just action RPGs, because, like, that actually involves some sort of, like... Okay, here we go. Tails itself. I don't know. I, I think she's cool. It's just... You're right. With the five characters we have... Played as so far, it kind of feels like they covered all their bases already, so I'm not really sure okay, what I need to remember. Left for I need, Leia to, to, I need do. to figure out what my arts are. And she kind of comes in late. Because we already have, like, like, quick monk, fighter, healer, because they combine so many things. We have, like, healer mage, we have, like, range attack mage, we have heavy ranger. Oh, no, okay. We have melee mage. Exactly. Okay, how do you backstep? Um, you have to... I, I think it's you have to click away with the with the um, analog stick, but, and like, just as they're getting ready to attack. Okay, because that, that is the key to using her elongated oh, staff. and you have to be uh, guarding with X. Gotcha. So, okay. while guarding, you, you press away and... I'm gonna try and, like... There it is. So did you did it glow? I wasn't watching. Um, I have to actually avoid an attack. That's oh, you just did the back step. Let's see. Yeah, there it is. Look at that. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's like by an appreciable amount too. It looks like you're fighting with a big Q-tip. Oh wow, she actually gets pretty ridiculous. Yeah. Gotta heal. Gotta heal. <laughs> spam heal. Spam heal. One more spam heal. Oh, I'm dizzy. So, do you have healing arts? We were doing the Lillian yeah, arts, we, and I think you have resurrection. She has, like, certain, like, abil like abilities of, like, everyone in a way. Like, she has resurrection, she has, like, barrier, she has a lot of support abilities. That's pretty cool. It's kind of weird. Do we actually, did we actually set her arts? Um, no, we did not. Go to the menu, because, like, I don't know what I'm using. We did everything else Okay, we her. have darting claw. Okay, this is, a. Uh, Okay, I'm going to. Okay, yeah, please. Uh, put her, yeah, put her healing ability, yeah, put her support abilities on uh, on the uh, right stick. Yeah. Yeah. Barrier and yeah, go, might as well do resurrection. Okay. What is elemental impulse actually? Um, elemental impulse. Give an elemental property to the attacks of a chosen ally. Which element is the luck of the draw? So I think you have to also, while using the spell, like select me to do that. That's kind of weak. I. I'm not feeling that one personally. I mean, okay, then let's... I'll, I'll equip it if you want it. But okay, darting claw, um, spiral strike, uh, Cerberus strike, 
And soaring vortex. Soaring vortex. Okay, now we're good. Now we're now I'm gonna be able to do more All stuff. Right. There you go, girl, girl, Keelik. All right. Essentially, I think that was a treasure right there. Yeah, it was. All right, well, let's try this now. Yeah, I guess it helps knowing what your moves are mapped to. Get freaking guard blockers. Like when when somebody's just constantly guarding, I don't know if I should just keep attacking them or like wait. But there's no reason to wait. You're still doing chip damage. It's just I feel like you're wasting your time, and there aren't many like piercing moves. Get out of here. <laughs> okay, I got now. the. Uh, don't worry, I got him in a swallow dance. Oh no, I didn't quite get that to work. There we go. Yeah, you're actually fighting real monsters here. <laughs> she, she's standing, like, super still. I like the idea of, like, half-frame half -frame glass. glass. What? Oh, okay. Like, so the frame is on the top part, but not the bottom part. I or, guess. Or maybe vice versa. That, maybe something like that. That's what my glasses are. Um, oh, yeah, they are. Yeah, the frames don't go underneath it. I gotta try out some of these support abilities. Yeah, Like, I've been focusing mainly on melee, but... With only two of us, we're getting kind of beat around here. Yeah. Uh, let's say we, let's say we, uh, oh, we got another, Let's uh, say we watch this. Also, I want to get the shiny real quick, real quick. What's the shiny? Insect, Insect wings. wings. All, All right, right, let's sketch. go. Laurent is just like you said, Jude. A little boondocks town. <laughs> yeah, I guess it is. But Laurent is home to an awesome landmark. Oh? What is it? It's called the Laurent Lodge. It's a haven of rest and healing with delicious food and a family atmosphere. Is that any different from other lodges? It's actually just Leia's house. The family atmosphere part is true, though. Her mom will scold you if you don't clean your plate. And if you aren't out of bed for breakfast, she'll wake you. So I'm not so sure about the rest and healing part. Damn it, Jude! Not in front of potential customers! But it's all true, isn't it? The most remarkable thing about Lorand is that it somehow produces people like you two. I will give Leia this much. She's fun. She is fun. She's very much fun. Um, we should actually probably be calling this, because I know it doesn't feel like it, because this episode was two different play sessions, but we're probably about at time. That's at, You're actually right. What's say we head... What's we, we make it to the, uh... To the Felgana mine, and then we'll pick it up once we end, once we get there. Okay, I can call that a deal. All right, sounds good. Okay, let's try some of these support abilities. Yeah, um, you gotta. Hang on, hang on. I'm gonna try this. Okay. Oh, you're Quiet. trying to. Okay. I'm drawing yeah, let, aggro, let me, so. Let me let me try it. Let me try it. Well, they're not attacking you, so you can't do it. Okay. Lag. We'll try it next time. We were so awesome. I I, I do still need to try these like support abilities, so. Um, let's, uh, see if we can find, uh, okay. Uh, we'll kill this Cabbage Patch first. Alright. Okay, so now I don't actually necessarily have to rely on Jude for healing. I do have first aid. Good, I was getting tired. We <laughs> we, we used to heal people together, Leia. Um, actually, she's I been... think you gotta go that way. You gotta shine it. I know, that, that's why I was going this way. Oh, there's a tunnel there. I saw it in the... There is? Uh, yeah, right uh, that way. Other uh, way, other way, other way, other uh, way. There. Uh, oh, Okay little hole in the wall. That, that's Probably a little hard to here. spy. Yeah, wow, this is pitch black. Okay. And, uh, I was so sure it would lead to some awesome secret place. Um, it kind of is. Leia, there's a treasure chest right there. That's a an thief's, awesome secret treasure. A thief's cape increases physical and, uh, and uh, Sorry, I was, arts defense. I was impatient. That's all right, it's all right. Um, we're going to have to do some, like, equipment uh, management once we actually get everyone else in back in the party. Yeah, we finally got everybody, like, nice and equipped. And then... They go and split up the entire party, so, like, all that money we spent on swords and stuff just gone in separate ways. <laughs> Alvin never reimbursed me for that buster sword I bought him. Nope. Okay, so, oddly enough, I'm starting to like her. You know what? Because I guess I think, she's... I think, I think it's because I'm playing as her, so I'm starting to see more... Of what she does like i still think that i like, mean there you go because you had to play as her yeah because i no have to else. play as her now because there's no one else but i'm now seeing more of what she does and it's actually kind of fun new character seems cool because they took away all the other cool characters <laughs> essentially uh save point next to a save point yeah. but i know I, how it is um i think here's a good place to stop although there I is a little path agree. right there if you want to check it out oh wait uh, look at the map look at the map 
Um, yeah, up there. Oh, yeah, I see what you mean. Little, little, no, no, no. little dog leg. Yep. All right, then. So, thank you guys for joining us for this episode of Let's Play Tales of Zillia. I'm the Comic Foil. I'm the Green Scorpion. And, and yeah, hopefully this, uh, hopefully this graphics card will stay together. Actually, this is a borrowed graphics card. New one's in the mail. But, uh, free warranty, so that was nice. Hopefully everything else stays working. Yeah. Seriously, dude. First your, first your capture card, now your graphics card. Oh, that wasn't even the first thing. It was a, um, it, it. It, it was my RAM card and my motherboard, and also Mila's legs. Oh, goodness gracious. Just everything breaking on me.